Hey guys, I've got a challenge for you. I want you to do this. I want you to do this tomorrow. Starting tomorrow, you're gonna do this. It's very simple. I found that a lot of you ask me questions of, hey Tyler, what does the next level look like? Hey Tyler, how do I double my business? How do I triple my business? How do I even get one more deal, right? And I'm telling you, a lot of us are out there doing things that we should not be doing. For example, I'm entering stuff into the MLS. That's not a producing item. I'm doing the transaction paperwork. That's not a producing item. I'm confirming appointments. That is not a producing item. You guys are all, and I see you guys all doing things that are not producing results for you. Producing results for me, contacting my sphere of influence, you know, contacting my past clients, stopping by their house, their work, you know, throwing client parties, meeting with business vendors, doing listing presentations, representing buyers and showing them property. Those are actually results that are gonna turn what I'm doing, the action item into a dollar. All the other things that you guys are doing are not. So here's my challenge to you. I want you to go get a timer, whether you have one at home because you bake, whether you have one in your office because you're crazy like me and you, you put everyone through the challenge, or you have a phone. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna set increments of 30 minutes. So you go to the office, you set the timer, and every 30 minutes it's gonna make a buzz. And when it makes a buzz, you're gonna write down what you're doing. Maybe it's, I'm putting property in the MLS. Maybe it's, I'm prepping a CMA. Maybe it's, I'm on Facebook, right? I, that happens to us, right? I get it, right? What I want you to do is I want you to write that down because I think you need to be self-aware of what you're doing with your day and you need to manage your day right. And to me, I take that and be a wake-up call of what I'm doing and what I should be doing and what I'm not doing. And what I want you guys to do is write down and put back in the comments how productive are you, right? Put a column A and put a column B. Column A is, I should be doing these things because they're gonna produce me a dollar tomorrow. The things that are B is, I probably should not be doing these things, I wanna delegate it out. Now, I know for a lot of you, you're gonna say, well, Tyler, I don't, I don't have the funds to hire an assistant, or what would you recommend for me? I'm just getting started. What I would recommend for you is to start small. In the beginning, guys, it was just me, and I guess what, I couldn't afford an assistant, so you know what I did? I went to our front desk receptionist, I said, hey, I'm looking for better ways that I can delegate things that I probably shouldn't be doing so I can get more deals. Are you looking to maybe do one or two hours of work after hours for me on my marketing material, on my entry in the MLS, on preparing X, Y, and Z, on putting my documents in my transaction management platform? Whatever it may be, that's what I would say, can you help me out? It's simple, guys. One or two hours, 10, 15 bucks, they want the work. You can actually not do the things you, you're supposed to. I mean, it's a no-brainer to me, and you're saving time. So that's where I would start. Number two, if you have the funds to get an assistant, great. You should get a transaction credit because you shouldn't be doing the paperwork, even better. Even, even better, you can get people in your office who are all watching this video and say, guys, let's partner up. Maybe we can get one full-time person and we all can split the cost between five of us and they can be doing all this stuff for us. And guess what? Your, your risk is much lower, even better. I mean, there's so many ways and I get the question all the time of, you know, how much, how do you have all the time, Tyler? How are you able to do it? Guys, I was organized. I knew what I needed to do. I kept my eye on the prize of what's gonna bring me in a commission check, seeing my people belly to belly, right? What is going to do that? And the things that did not, I was so strict about it, I delegated it out. I delegated it out because I knew every time I was getting down in the weeds of actual stuff I should not be doing, I was killing my business for the long run. So that's my challenge to you today. I want you to actually take this form, download it, I got it for you. You can do this challenge. And then I want you to know, you, to put in the comments, how productive were you? Was it 50-50? Was it 40-30? What was your takeaway from it? Side note, guys, you definitely still should watch my videos, whether it be during a break, in between appointments, in the car, waiting for an inspection. Do it when it matters, but make sure you keep watching. Ciao.